Hello, fourth graders. Miss Clark here. I thought maybe you could use just a little review on partial quotient division. So, let's see what we can work out together this morning. Are you ready? Okay, so I have a one digit and then I have a three digit number that's being divided by the one digit number. This number here is going to be my divisor and this number here is going to be my dividend. All right, let's get to work. I'm looking that I have five. Five is going to be a number that I want to use to make new numbers with friendly numbers. So I'm going to use friendly numbers like two, five, and 10. All right, so I use my divisor, just some friendly numbers that are easy to multiply, and I came up with some new numbers here. The purpose of coming up with these numbers here is to help me with all of the numbers that I'm going to subtract to make this dividend as small as I possibly can to a number that's less than five or maybe even zero. So let's take a look for just a second it is going to be a number in the hundreds, but right now I've made numbers that are in the tens. So I want to take a look at these first two digits right here. I have a five, and five times something I know gets me close to 36. Well, looking over here at my list, I see that 25 is, is close, but I think I could get even closer. Let's see, I know 5 times 6 is 30, and I know 5 times 7 is 35. Oh wow, look, I'm one digit away. But I need to make this number in the hundreds, because this is 360. So I'm going to use that strategy of taking the divisor and the 7, and add a zero. And now, when I multiply five times seven, I know that's 35, and I'm gonna add that zero, and now I have 350. So we're gonna use this friendly number set right here. Okay, if you'll remember when you're doing partial quotient division, you have like a list out to the side right here. All right, each of these numbers has to be placed in this problem. Okay, all right, let's get ready to make that happen. Okay, the five is already in the problem because it's the divisor. All right, the 70 is what we call the friendly number that we use to create a new number. Only friendly numbers get to join the list. I'm going to put it right here. Okay, now the 350, this number I'm going to use to subtract from this number. Okay, now we subtract. 0 subtract 0. 6 subtract 5 is 1. And three take away three, I don't have anything left there. <gasps> now I have 10. All right, I look at my divisor. Five, five times two to the friendly number. Look at that, it makes 10. Now I'm gonna use this friendly number set. The five is the divisor, it's in the problem. The two is the friendly number I used so it gets to make the friendly number list. And then the 10 is going to be subtracted out. It has to also go inside the problem. And look at that, we have nothing left. All right, I'm not quite finished yet. There's one more step. I need to add my list together and that's gonna give me my quotient. So the quotient for this problem 
is going to be 72 with zero remainders. A remainder would be a number smaller than five that would be left over, but we don't have one. Okay, I hope this was helpful, and I'll make another video where we do use a problem that has remainders. Thanks for watching. Happy learning.